A new sleigh. Come on, let's talk about that. It is 3 p.m. right now, and I'm getting ready to go shopping because I have a party, a birthday party tonight, and I have nothing to wear. Nothing at all. And honestly, this whole entire day has been far from what I expected. Um, I was supposed to edit a video, upload a video, and also film a video this morning. And what did I do today? Switch up signs and symptoms of ADHD. <laughs> I didn't even intro. Hey guys. It's me, Courtney. Welcome to my channel. As for now, I have a birthday party to attend tonight, and I have nothing to wear. So, I'm supposed to be meeting Tati. If you guys don't know who Tati is, Tati is my friend. She, literally one of the first people I ever met in LA. Love her, but um, I'm supposed to be meeting her at House of CB to get a dress for tonight, but I'm here, late, as per usual. So let me get my water ready, and we out. And before we continue the video, this video is sponsored by Air Up. Y'all, I have been struggling to get as much water as possible every single day. Like, I try my best, and honestly, I don't drink juices. I don't really drink anything. But what I do drink every single day is water, okay? Every single day. And the easiest way I've been getting my water intake is literally by using my Air Up water bottle. If you guys don't know what Air Up is, it's honestly like a new way of drinking water, which sounds really, really insane, but I absolutely love it. As you can see, there's this thing right here on top of my water bottle. So basically, as I'm drinking, my water I'm basically smelling this flavor but it triggers my brain to taste watermelon I don't get I don't understand the science behind it but I'm down and also it comes with so many different flavors all you do is fill up your water bottle and then pop a pod on the top of this and the flavors of the plants and the fruit and everything will light your brain up what it honestly feels like magic but it's just science it's literally just science and I'm telling you if you have an issue taking in a lot of water every single day please try this out because it honestly just makes drinking water more fun like why drink flavorless water when you can have flavor okay but like i said guys if you guys want to try the air up water bottle or even get the pods click the link in my description box because i'm a huge fan a huge fan i'm telling you now try it anyways let's go let's go um i don't think i want to drive and honestly as each day goes on i fall more and more in love with my rug ignore my socks on the couch but come on this matches perfectly i'm not gonna lie Okay. Ah! Is it actually cute? I can't tell. Ah! What is this? Oh, this is for the floor. Oh, that's smart. Mm. Why is it like not big? Oh my god, I'm so grossed out. Y'all, I have to search up directions. I promise I'm not slow. I just don't understand what's going on. Okay, it's not sticking to the ground. I don't know. I am out of breath, but I put it down. Let me show y'all. It's actually pretty cute. It's like a marble design. I just wish it was bigger. Like I should have measured this cause I, one thing I love about a living room is a big rug. Like I love that. So I wish it was bigger, but I kind of like it. Yay. Okay, the Uber's still not here. He's still two minutes away. <laughs> I feel like two minutes just passed, but. Y'all, I'm still. <laughs> I'm telling you it's not making sense. Honestly, when I first got this, I was like, I don't really get it. Like, how am I going to taste a flavor that I'm not sipping? Science, science. I may not have always loved my science classes, but one thing I'll appreciate is scientists because they really took their time. They really took their time to learn this. Um, the Uber is not moving. I'm kind of confused. He's literally not moving, bruh. Maybe he's at a light. Let me text Tati. Bro, I was literally just about to Like, the Ubers, I'm not trying to be late, for real. But, like, the Ubers are not connecting. Like, no, no that was happening to me earlier. I have to restart my phone. It's fine. I'm still looking for a dress. How's this? Okay, hold on. Ooh, that's cute. <gasps> that was the one I saw online. That is cute. <laughs> that is cute. I just been ballin' out every season Know there's some niggas I left in the beach I just been married to double cup I got up on me and born inside another leaf so currently at House of CB, I got a couple pieces. Tati helped me. Yes. And hopefully it's gonna fit me because the last time I came here, the sizes weren't sizing. I'm gonna take out I hope so. I'm thinking of getting this one, but I'm not sure. Wish me luck. And it's hot. 
Jason, Jason from Selling Sunset is here. Alert, alert. Jason from Selling Sunset is here. Get him on camera. Imagine hey, if Jason. I just... Hey, Jason. <laughs> Anyways, got some clothes from House of CB, and now we're about to go to Rodeo because we may or may not need bags and shoes. Okay. Bagging? Mm-hmm. Oh my God, it's so hot. This reminds me of Texas. Is your name? Tati. I'm just hoping that I'm gonna find like a bag that I actually want to wear tonight. Ooh, that is so cute. Currently in Prada, still haven't found anything. Um, Stop doing that to people's cameras, bro. You've never seen me do that before. <laughs> yes, I have. Bop this now. Who do you think? You think you're doing away? <laughs> and we're out. Thank you. Thank you. So where are we off to next? We're about to go and eat. The music is too loud, but I'm starving, so I need it now. It is 8 p.m. and we're supposed to be leaving to go to this party around 9 p.m. And I don't even know what I'm wearing. I got two dresses from House of CB and I have no idea which one I'm gonna wear. And I have to do my makeup, like I'm just like, I kind of don't want to go. Kind of don't want to go, but I'm just going to go because I already said yes to going and that's done on that. I'm going to do my makeup and then try on the fits and I'll get back to y'all. Okay? Bye. So, I am finally ready. This is kind of a preview of my outfit, this bag, and... I'm off, I'm off, I'm off, I'm off. I was gonna show you the other dresses that I had as an option, but I was honestly running too late, like me and Tati are trying to go. So let me show y'all in the mirror. So, oh, Tati's here. This is the fit, this is the fit coming. Jesus, welcome, welcome. Hi. We're going to be pre-gaming before we go. Um, hopefully we get there on time because we're kind of late right now. Hey, we're on a time crunch. Yeah, we're on a time crunch, okay? Hey, six shots. Six, Jesus, yeah. yeah. Six shots, then we can go. Okay, okay, let's play the music so we can get Worth it. it. Oh. Let me work it. I put my thing down, flip it and reverse it. It's your primitive is when you had number four. It's your primitive is when you had number four. If you got a big, let me search it. You found out how hard I gotta work, yeah. It's your primitive is when you had number four. It's your primitive is when you had number four. Get to know ya so I can show ya Put a hurtin' on ya like I told ya Give me all your numbers so I can phone ya Your girl act and stink then call me over It is Monday, August 15th And I did not update y'all about the party Though I don't know if I told y'all But I went to Marseille Martin's 18th birthday party And I had a blast Like I always heard that celebrity parties are always boring But I don't know about this one It was really fun And like I literally went to House of CB Like I showed y'all and found an outfit And the most shocking thing happened And this has never happened to me By the way It's never happened to me Ever So I'm walking out the Uber Right And by this point I think we're like we're kind of late, but not really. We're like late to the point where like doors close in like 30 minutes, okay? And so I'm coming out of the Uber and there's a girl that's passing by my door and literally I get out and she gets, and she's walking by and we have the exact same dress on. The exact same dress! I could not believe this. This has never happened to me in my life. And then it's the fact that like, we're passing each other at the exact same time. Like the moment I get dropped off, she's passing right by me. And so I get out and we're like, oh, 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 oh. Literally, we, like there is no words for like a minute. Then I was like, it's okay girl, we look good. Even though in my head I'm like, what? Just go wear my same dress. But she did look good, so it didn't even matter. But we had to do a COVID test right before we got in. So it's like we're standing right next to each other with the exact same dress getting a covid test and it's almost like we planned this like i don't know i couldn't believe it and like as you guys could see like my dress is vibrant it's like a vibrant lime green like 
you cannot see me, okay? Other than that, I don't think I saw her again. I was also very worried that like, if I go in there, there's gonna be somebody else wearing my exact same dress too. Like there's gonna be multiple people. But anyways, other than that, the party was super fun. I, the only thing that like really, really shocked me and made me feel like, wow, like people really watch my videos is when sometimes I'd like randomly compliment some girl on her dress. Like I might be like, oh my God, I love your dress. And then they'll be like, thank you. And then right after they'll be like, oh, oh my God, by the way, I really, really love your channel. And so that was like an awakening. I'm like, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You watch my videos? <laughs> like what? Are you sure? Are you sure? Yeah, that was a really, really nice moment because it's like I didn't expect that at all. And yeah, I don't know. Sometimes I just forget that like celebrities watch YouTube and like they watch Instagram. Like they, they, they're literally on social media, you know? Other than that, yeah, I just had a blast. Today is Monday and I'm about to upload a YouTube video. I'm uploading another scary gameplay video. I was actually supposed to upload this on Friday, but background music was copyrighted, all of that. So I had to like change all of that this morning. And I was asking my spam page because I made a spam because like, Posting on like my main is so like daunting like I just cannot post on there I having subscribers on my social media makes it easier for me to post But then when I start following people from real life, it's like oh my god like now I feel like I'm doing too much, like I'm overthinking what I'm posting and I just don't have the energy. So I made the spam so like literally my closest friends and also my subscribers can just follow me there and I can just be 100% myself. And you may be wondering like, why can't you just be yourself in your main? I'm sorry, it's not that easy. It's not that easy. I was asking y'all to help me choose a thumbnail. Look, for today's video, as you can see, um, cause I was having like issues. I didn't know which one I should choose. Um, but y'all really like the bottom one. So I'm really glad that I have this fan page so I can ask for y'all's opinion immediately whenever, you know, is necessary. Because at the end of the day, like y'all are the ones that are watching the video and I want to know what y'all would click. The only thing I have left for today is I'm going to film. Let me upload my video. Everything is ready. I think I'm going to schedule it to go live in three minutes. Ah! The video should be live right now. That was fast. You know, time is going by too fast. I think something's changing the universe. Whoa, 300 comments in a minute. <sighs> I don't know if I've said this before, but like reading the comments is my favorite part. Okay, y'all, so just finished responding to comments, posting. I was also like accepting a lot of people onto my spam page. So that was fun. Um, I didn't know that Instagram, you can only accept like 200 people at a time. So it was taking a while because a lot of people followed. But um, I already love my spam. I, I literally already love it. Like, oh, I just hate the pressure of Instagram. Like, I just want to be free. And I know like I can easily just say I don't care, but it's not that easy. Okay. But anyways, um, I'm going to set up my lights and camera so I can film. Um, and then I'm gonna make breakfast and then we're gonna film. We're gonna film. It's a productive Monday, okay? Whoa. Don't make me wait too long, too long. Five niggas shut some way too long, too long. Time's again, I'ma bring my phone, my phone. Perfect, you can't do wrong. Don't make me wait too long. Slide on your favorite song. Let me find out you faded low. I pull up, but I can't stay too long. Fly, uh, yeah. Look, I ain't got all day, baby. Money to make. Breakfast is served. I'm not even gonna lie. This is honestly what I eat every day. Almost every day. Oatmeal. The huge. I love my oatmeal. If you don't like oatmeal, you just don't know how to make it. Okay. And then boiled eggs. I absolutely love eggs. Yeah, that's all I'm eating right now. And then I'm watching the show Erased. I literally watched this exact same show last year. But one, I didn't finish it. And then two, I feel like I wasn't like in a focused state. Like, so now I feel like I'm really, really enjoying the show because I'm really paying attention. And if you don't know what Erased is, it's an anime that's on Netflix. And it's basically about this guy who has like visions. He knows when something bad is about to happen, but he doesn't know exactly what's going to happen, but he knows something's gonna happen that's bad. And so basically a girl when he was in elementary school was kidnapped and he thinks that he's able to solve the mystery. I've really been enjoying that. And like, if y'all have any other animes that are similar to that, like I really like animes that are just like, it's like that. 
you know, like a thriller or like where you have to solve a mystery. Like it's not every day like, oh, fighting this person, fighting this team. You know, sometimes I just want like a chill anime that's like, okay, I like this, like a mystery. I ain't got all day, baby. Money to make and I've been trying to get paid. I got they feel it's grown women sentimental couple foreign things flying in and out of LA. I'm not a player. I got a Hola, como estas? Right now, I'm drinking some coffee before I film, and then I just had some pineapples as like a little snack before I start. Um, because right when I'm done filming, I'm eating dinner. Honestly, this whole entire day, I feel very, very productive. I'm glad that I got a majority of the stuff that I wanted to do done. This is literally the last thing on my list. Actually, that's not true. There's a couple other stuff on my list, but it's like really small, so. Sipping on my coffee, if it ain't black, take it back. You already know. I hope this vlog has been interesting because um, honestly, this is my everyday life. I literally don't really do much, but just work, kind of. Actually, that's not every day, it's Monday. Anyways, now I'm actually gonna try and film. I'm gonna take my phone. Wait, let me double check any notifications. I have nothing. I keep on checking my notifications as if something's gonna randomly pop up. Anyways, we're gonna put it in the closet. Okay. See you later. <laughs> yes. So now I actually have to film. Um, we done playing games. Done playing games. I just finished filming. As you can see, the whole setup is here. Um, I definitely did not start filming when I said I was gonna film. I literally started at seven o'clock because I was stuck on TikTok. But I'm just glad that I got the video out of the way because I really wanted to push it to another day. Like, I just wasn't feeling it. Like, um, and then also when I was filming, there's another apartment that's like right across from my apartment. I have my windows open, but I have these lights, right? And so with these lights, it's shining right on me and my apartment is dark. And I know for a fact these people can see me literally filming. And I just, I was getting very nervous. But I'm just glad I got it out of the way. And literally right before I started filming, I got a comment that made me think, I was like, wait, you're actually right. It says, don't know how this lady sits in front of a camera and talks to absolutely no one without going insane. And you know what? I never thought about that. One, I'm actually not talking to anyone. Like, the only reason we don't see it as weird is because I upload it to YouTube and I have a camera. But if there is no camera here, it looks like I'm insane. Even though I do have my moments. I, when I'm home alone, yes, I be talking to myself. Who gonna stop me? Who gonna fight me? Okay? I'm actually like talking to the camera as if there's someone in this room. Like, I'm just like, hey guys, who is guys? Who is guys? <laughs> do you know what I mean? <laughs> Time to eat. Wait, first I'm gonna change. I cannot be wearing jeans. That's crazy. Okay, so this is what we're wearing. Okay. 8 p.m. time for dinner. So this is actually what I've been eating almost every day the last couple of days eating rice with Nigerian stew as you can see I'm Nigerian and I made this stew like like last week like last weekend and I absolutely love it mm, I cannot wait to eat it so I've just been eating rice like every single day this has been keeping me full and satisfied okay and it's better than getting fast food we use paper plates no one's washing dishes okay I feel like I haven't eaten all day but I have I cannot wait to eat. I was so frustrated the last few days because the rice that I made, I actually got it from Target and I don't usually get rice from Target. And the last like couple of days, I've been trying to make the rice. And I don't use like a rice cooker or anything. I usually just, you know, I make rice like a regular way. I never have an issue making rice. Like rice is something that I know how to make because when I was at home with my family, like that was something we ate like all the time. So we just had to know how to cook it. And so I was trying to make the rice and every single time I guess I would put too much water or whatever But I genuinely feel like that rice absorbs too much water like way too fast Like I don't know how to explain it, but I was just very very Stressed out the last couple of days when I figured out a routine And you know the rice comes out perfect every time now, so that's all that matters, okay? Oh Yes Yes and it's done, girl. 
And you know what? Rice is one of those like things that is good in every country. Like you can't mess up rice. Rice is good everywhere. Everywhere. This should be illegal. This should be illegal. Mm. Mm. Wow. You know what? I did the dang thing with this stew. This I think I'm going to end the vlog here just because there's really nothing that's going to happen now. I'm literally going to put on a show to watch while I eat my food and then respond to a couple emails. But that's pretty much it. There's nothing else exciting happening tonight. So I will see you guys all in my next vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm going to try and be more consistent with vlogging and this entire thing because I do enjoy vlogging and I want to build the confidence of vlogging in public especially. It's just like I don't think my life is that interesting. But I don't think y'all mind watching it. So I don't know. I don't know. Okay. So I will see you guys on my next video in my next vlog. I love you and peace.